can't contain Constantine in a nutshell. <laughs> you just can't. You can't put Constantine in a box. <laughs> yeah, you can't. It's can't. too unique. Yeah. And it's got so many places mm. and so many cultures. And yeah. because the disciplines interlap and interact, you can't separate the disciplines. Yeah. Even so. though in other universities they actually are separated, but here they're not. So they are. that's what makes us unique. Maybe integration is the word. Yeah. I chose Cornerstone because it wasn't linked to a particular denomination. It's not just feeding you like a doctrine. It's really m making you think about why you think the things that you do. We have lots of different disciplines and that means that there are psychologists and sociologists and theologians and we learn to be together and work together. I think what I really, really love is the integration of mm. faith and every other area of life. Yeah, because faith should be in every mm. other area of our life and not separated yeah. to just Bible study or yeah. theology. Is this space to ask hard questions at Cornerstone? Definitely. There's a real sense of reality. It's, uh, it's got a family feeling to it. The community's close. You can go and chat to your lecturers and find out what's what and talk about things and be honest with them. And the same with your students. You can work together and share ideas. Yeah. So you actually get to know mm. the lecturer students, and the yeah. lecturer gets to know the students. Yeah, they're like you're not just a number, mm. you just get to know people from a lot of different cultural yeah. backgrounds, which is awesome. Because it just goes back to the whole thing of like learning doesn't occur like in a in a vacuum. So like you have to like be with people, like you can't just learn on your own. If somebody told me that um, studying theology isn't very practical, I'd probably tell them to come to Cornerstone and you'll find out that that's not true. <laughs> Since I've been here, it's blown all my expectations. What I didn't realise was, you know, I had my career and then I thought separate to that was, you know, being Christ-centred and now it's just integrated the two. Um, just given me new purpose and, and new fulfilment in my career as well. Growing up as a young Christian, I thought that Christianity is all about going to heaven about getting that ticket and say, I'm saved, I'm going to heaven, then that's it. But now it, I'm, I'm, I have come to realize that there, there are more years to live, and while we are still living, there is a responsibility that I have to play in the community. We are studying um, about God, and God is active in all aspects of life, social life, political life, economic life, spiritual life, and also like in all the areas of like family, and also the individual life. So it is, it is very relevant and it's also like I'm able to, to help us as students um, to be the change and, and the influence into the communities where we are coming from. A lot of our students who come to a college and want to get training to work in the church, but I think at Cornerstone you learn that it's all the way around, is that we're not here to work for the church, but we're here to be the church to work for the world. I think if we look at the story of South Africa, we can definitely see there was a lot of pain and struggle. And as Christians, we are called to be part of God's story and partner with Him and making the world a better place. You come into thinking it's about you and about God, but in reality, it's about the whole world. And it's about how to interact in every single situation um, in a way that glorifies God and that you reveal God through yourself.